what about AI? Today, in early 2023, the AI-enabled processing market is barely crawling, but Quadra already supports several applications. Can you mention a few? The, the primary applications that we see so far are region of interest in coding. And that's really cool because, you know, we're, we have a video right now and it's a great example. So you're recording, I'm recording. Most people are going to focus on our faces and not anywhere else in the video. And what region of interest in coding does or facial recognition does is it recognizes that region, applies most of the bandwidth in that region, and then slowly degrades quality away from that region so that you see, you know, the, the, the regions of interest where people are focused is going to be the highest possible quality where they're not focused quality might degrade a bit. So that's one. And that's, you know, that's pretty key to all uh, types of video, including or especially those that are transmitted at low bandwidth. And other things that we're seeing are more security-like applications where you know, object detection or license plate detection or conversion of license plates to text so that um, you know, that's efficiently done on the board and only the textual information can be sent back, which is more efficient than sending the video and doing that type of operation in the, uh, in the facility itself.